Welcome back to Daybreak this morning. The coronavirus pandemic has affected just about every business there is. From large to small, it has not held back. But it's not all bad either. One business in West Michigan is enjoying a boom in sales like never before. News Ace Justin Kolar's in studio with how Grand Rapids' freewheeler bike shop is cruising through COVID. Well, Teresa and Casey, if you've seen more bikes cruising throughout downtown Grand Rapids lately, you're not alone. A surge in cycles. It's an unintended positive result of the pandemic, which forced everyone to self-isolate and stay indoors. As things slowly reopened, people quickly hit the pavement to find a city welcoming them. Okay. Open the door, turn the sign on, and here comes the let the dam low. So. Shifting into high gear. You couldn't expect it. You couldn't prepare for it. It's been nuts. Freewheeler Bike Shop, still open for business. We were busier than ever. They, like many businesses, felt the wrath of 2020, forced to close for weeks during what would be their busiest season. I've heard in the past of some crazy seasons, but this is uh, by far the craziest I've seen. Unlike many businesses, however, they've spun loss into luxury. So it went from, went from zero to 100 really fast because two or three weeks went by and we're like, we're gonna run out of bikes and I would have never thought that. Their bikes driving out the door in droves. If you've seen more rims on the road, you're not alone. The cycle spike, a side effect of COVID, Mayor Rosalind Bliss is cool with. I think getting people um, outside and people being more active is always a good thing. But the city launched its first bicycle summit a decade ago. Bliss says their foresight is paying off. We have done a lot of work here at the city to build bike bike lanes um, to be more intentional, to make sure that there's connectivity. We adopted a, a pretty comprehensive bicycle action plan. The folks at Freewheeler hope they can keep up with demand. Get a bike if you can find one, no matter where it is, I guess. So we're grateful for sure. Well, Freewheeler tells us, Teresa and Casey, that many people can't get their hands on new bikes and they're bringing them old bikes to repair. They typically get you in and out of there in about three days. They tell us now with this surge to expect to wait about a week before they get you back on the road. We'll have more information for you on our website at woodtv.com this morning. In the studio, Justin Kolar, News 8.